Hello everyone and welcome to another BCP library video. My name is Katie and today I'm going to show you how you can make these stickers yourself at home. You don't need any fancy sticker paper, you can make them very easily at home. So what you need is some paper that you can draw on or you can use my design sheet which I have put in the video description. You need some sticky tape, some scissors and the secret ingredient is some parchment wax paper and this is baking paper that you use for baking and you just need to make sure it's wax paper but your grown up at home will be able to help you and you also need your favourite colouring supplies. And this is the sheet that I have made and I'm going to use and you can find it in the description down below and you can print it out yourself if you want to. So first of all, you need to decide what you want to turn into stickers. This is my sheet that I'm going to colour in and you can use this sheet if you like or you can draw your own designs. It is totally up to you. You can either draw something, you can draw your favourite animal, your favourite character, your favourite game or you can cut some pictures out of magazines maybe or you can print some off of the computer. It's totally up to you. These are your stickers. It's your own personal taste. I'm colouring in a cactus and a unicorn and a dinosaur because those are my favourite ones. I really like unicorns so I want to make myself a unicorn sticker. And when you are happy with your designs you just need to cut them out and I'm cutting out the white space around my pictures because this looks a little bit more like stickers you buy in shops but it's up to you. You can cut close to the line if you want to if you don't want the white space. It's totally up to you. I just like that so that's what I am doing myself. And when you are done you will have all of your designs cut out like this and then you need to bring in your wax paper. So what you need to do is get your sticky tape and cover a good area of your wax paper with sticky tape and you make sh need to make sure you smooth it down and overlap the sticky tape so there are no gaps so the back of our stickers will be sticky. So this will be the back of our stickers and we will be putting our shapes on top. You might need to get an adult to help you maybe cut the sticky tape one of you can place it down and one can cut but you can do it by yourself as well so once you have got your sticky tape in place on your parchment paper you'll be able to see that your design fits on top and you just need to make sure that there's a little bit of a gap all the way around your design like there is with this unicorn there's a bit of sticky tape all the way around like you can see and you can put maybe two designs on one part of your parchment paper and when you have got the designs on your paper on top of the sticky tape you then need to cover them with sticky tape in exactly the same way as we've just done and you need to make sure that the sticky tape overlaps your design and there are no gaps so you need to overlap the paper and overlap the sticky tape too so there are no gaps And once you are done, it will look something like this. As you can see, the paper is enclosed nicely between the two layers of sticky tape and then you just need to cut them out. And for this, you need to make sure you do leave a space around your design so you can see some of the parchment paper because otherwise your stickers will just fall off, they won't stick. And when you are done, you will have your stickers like this and you can either peel them and use them straight away or you can save them for another time because the wax paper will keep the stickers sticky like normal stickers are. So here are my collection of stickers that I made. I really like the cactus and the unicorn and I'm going to put my cactus on this, this cup that I have here which I put another one of my stickers on and you just need to peel off the wax paper like I'm doing here peel it off and your tape will still be sticky and you can stick your stickers wherever you like and because it's sticky tape it's going to be quite a sticky sticker so it shouldn't peel off. And there we go. And you can stick your stickers anywhere you like, maybe you want to stick them to your toy box, to your pencil case, to a notebook. You just have fun creating as many stickers as you like. I'm going to put my unicorn sticker onto my bead box because I think the colours go really nicely and I just thought that would look really nice. 
But again, you can use your stickers however you want to. You can maybe save them and give them out as presents to people, or you can make greetings cards with them. It is totally up to you. This method is really, really easy and you don't need any fancy supplies. You can do it with the stuff you have at home. So these are my stickers. You can make these yourself if you want to. Like I said, there is a link where you can download the designs in the description below, or you can draw your own. So now it's time for you to have fun at home making some stickers.